What's going on, YouTube? Sorry, I haven't been on here. Sorry, not sorry. Actually, not sorry at all. Because I've been working my ass off doing other stuff. So, you know, that's good. But today, I'm going to show you how to make a cafe cubano. Um, and we're using a mocha pot and also go to Target and go get you one. It's like 20 bucks, not that bad. Or buy it on Amazon. I like mine though because uh, it's silver and black. Looks pretty cool. Let's get into making that coffee. Let's go. Alright, so we're back in my Mike's Coffee Grind Cafe. <laughs> uh, what should we use? I think we're gonna go. I did do this earlier actually. Um, so we are going to use South Indian coffee. Well, actually, that I was watching a bunch of YouTube videos on, they're using like sugar and they're basically pouring the espresso, which is coming out of here, into here, and basically mixing it up until it's brown sugar, basically, or, or like brown espresso sugar. You know what I mean? Um, anyways, I hang out with a lot of brown people, or I did, <laughs> aka South Indian. So, this is the healthier version. Um, because I like making great, delicious coffee. This is Jagger. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right. But we're going to go ahead and add a couple spoonfuls into here. But get our espresso and mix it together like that into this glass bowl. So I do want to explain something while this is actually going. Because this is kind of like a cooking show. A.K.A. I'm making coffee. This is Mike's coffee grind. <laughs> I do want to explain something. Not like the science behind it. But like technically. So once this is going and actually it gets... To a point where you can get a little bit of espresso out of your mocha pot. You generally want to use a spoon or something like this and then pour it in there and then just whip it together basically. You're like whip it, whip it good. <laughs> but, um, like I said, I've watched a couple of YouTube videos. Not that making coffee is hard to do because making espresso and coffee is, is fine. Um, it's easy, but a lot easier is you can just pour a little bit in here once it starts brewing. Then mix that together, then put it back in your coffee. Yeah, anyways, you can make a latte and cappuccino kind of out of this. But yeah, that's just me. You could make those kinds of drinks out of this as well. Or you could just have it completely normal and traditional like this. I'm just saying. <laughs> Give her a taste test, shall we? Eh, hey, molto bene. <laughs> but anyways, thank you for watching this video. And if you like coffee as much as I do, or making espresso as much as I do, you know, I think it's fun. I think it's a fun thing to do. It's kind of like my little hobby that's... I do it all the time. <laughs> I make coffee pretty much every day. <laughs> um, I don't know if that shows through the video. Anyways, <laughs> uh, yeah, like, share, and subscribe, and uh, I'll see you in the next one. Take it easy.